Hello, my name is Maciej Lesiak. I'm from Poznan, Poland. And this is my pleasure to take part in this uh, pitfalls and troubleshooting session. So my job today is uh, to talk on the balloon side branch rescue technique. Uh, this is my disclosure. So how to manage abruptly occluded side branch? I mean, the abruptly occluded means that there is no flow at all, so the steam is zero. So first, we usually attempt to rewire through the main vessel stent struts using multiple wires. If it doesn't work, you can try another pot with a larger balloon, but then you will have some troubles with proper balloon positioning because you can't see a, a side branch ostium. But also, you can try using a jade wire to open the side branch. This is very nice illustration from Francesco Burzotta paper published a couple of years ago, how to do this. So you can appreciate on the left hand side, the main vessel stent implanted uh, across the take of the side branch with a jade wire, which is marked in, in, in red or pink here. Uh, and uh, you can use this wire uh, and insert a low profile balloon over this jade wire across uh, and push it outside the stand struts down to the to the archery to the side branch uh, and by doing this you can obtain a flow uh, into the side branch but before you inflate a balloon in the um, in the side branch the, this rescue balloon in a side branch is very reasonable to position the main vessel balloon just to be able to correct the uh, deformation of a stand you may create with the side branch balloon. So on the right hand side, you, you, you can see the, the side branch opening. And once the flow is restored, you can access the, the side branch through the struts of the stand, uh, after which uh, you can inflate the main vessel balloon and correct uh, the stand deformation. Unfortunately, sometimes it's not enough, you know, it, it, you still cannot uh, recross the side branch uh, with the wire, especially if there is some dissection in the side branch. And in this time, you can convert uh, your provisional procedure into the reverse uh, inverted uh, crush technique, which was published uh, a couple of years ago by uh, uh, Manuel Pan uh, group. Uh, so this is how to do it. Uh, do this. This is uh, inverted crush technique. So once again, you you have a jade wire by the main vessel stent. Uh, you push the balloon uh, outside the stent struts uh, down the, uh, uh, over the jade wire to open the side branch. Uh, but then uh, you position a big balloon over the jade uh, wire and crush the main vessel stent. And thus, you may have enough room to position a stent into the side branch and do the regular inverted crush technique. Uh, so I try to find uh, some kind of cases uh, in my library, but the only one I find is, uh, I found is a little bit different case. So this is a complex LED diagonal bifurcation uh, I, tr I treated many years ago in 81 year old male patient with uh, quite severe angina class three. Uh, so you see a very diffuse uh, lesion on the LAD uh, with some perhaps involvement of the, of the, pro of the proximal uh, diagonal. But my approach here was inverted culotte with uh, dedicated stents. So we used uh, that times Triton which as you all remember was the bare metal stent at that time. Uh, so I, what I wanted to do is, was to position the Triton stand into, in the diagonal branch uh, and then stand the main vessel in the inverted culotte technique. Uh, so I started with pre-dilatation, uh, side branch and main vessel with 2.0, 2.5 uh, balloon. Uh, now you, you see the uh, Triton stand positioning uh, and implantation, and that's the result after the implantation. Very nice result as for the side branch, but very poor uh, as for the main vessel. So you see that 
in this situation now, I have a jailed wire. Uh, the, the wire in the LED is jailed by the Triton stent. Uh, and I tried to, I made a lot of my, many, many attempts to rewire through the Triton stents down to the, to the LED. And the problem was that with every attempt, my wire was going uh, subintimally. So I was not able to find uh, the, the, the right lumen of the, of the LED. And this is uh, how I came across to this uh, balloon rescue side branch technique, but not actually uh, for the side branch band, but this time for the main vessel. So I use this jailed wire in the LED uh, and uh, over this jailed wire, I push down the, the side branch, the, the, the small balloon. This is 1.5 balloon uh, over the jailed wire. Uh, I managed to open the, uh, the LED and predilate uh, the mid portion of the vessel with two zero balloon. Then I crushed the stand, uh, protruding uh, Triton stand in main vessel with 2.5 and then three O balloon. So this is the crushing. And finally, I managed to position two stands, the, the, the first stand distally to the, um, to the bifurcation and the proximal stand, which was three O uh, uh, long stand in the, in the proximal mid portion of the LAD. Uh, with pots, keys, and uh, final pots. Uh, with this, perhaps suboptimal, especially for the mid portion of the LED result, but at least uh, you can appreciate that the TIMI free flow is, is back to the vessel and the patient is safe. So this is, uh, you see the uh, June 2011, so you may, you may think uh, what was the long-term result of this complex procedure, especially considering uh, uh, that the Triton was bare metal stent. So this is a surprise because I managed to check the patient after 21 months. So uh, this is March, 2013. And you can appreciate that the long-term result uh, is quite uh, good. The, there is no restenosis and the flow is okay for in, in both vessels. So just to, to summarize uh, this, this technique. So jail wire is the basics of side branch protection. And if you protect your side branch with a wire, uh, you have a lot of advantages of this technique because you, you can widen the, the bifurcation angle, you can preserve side branch patency, permit side branch location in case of abrupt occlusion after main vessel stentic, but also, which is very important, this technique allows you to rescue an included side branch. Thank you very much for your attention.